In this video, I will give you some answers to this question. How do you build an audience for your business? Please give the video a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can be notified straight away as soon as I upload new content. Thank you very much. Let's get started. If you would like me to create any videos for you on any topics, tell me in the comments under the video. Knowing how to build a highly engaged audience of people and having lots of fans and followers is not very useful if you can't get them to purchase things from you. What you want to think about doing is to cultivate and talk to your audience more so you can generate more sales and create extra income. You may be asking, how can I do that? Well, the first thing you can do is you want to start and build an email list. An email list is a good asset to have for any online business. It can be a very powerful marketing tool. To help you build an email list, there are many useful tools available such as Aweber, MailChimp and others like ConvertKit. If you begin to build an email list, you will likely find that having a responsive email list can be like your digital ATM machine in which most of the time that you send out an email promotion to your list, this is assuming that you are promoting a product that people can buy or a service, it will very likely generate you more income. Now, one of the better methods you can use to collect emails is to set up a simple landing page and you simply send people from your social media platforms like Facebook and Instagram profiles to this page. If you want to use paid ads, you can even send targeted paid ads to a landing page. This way can help you build an email list quicker. However, it will depend on how much money you spend on your ads. You can also use things like exit pop-ups on your website or content upgrades to entice people who visit your website to join your email list in exchange for a free gift. By giving people who visit your website a free gift, something like a PDF download or some free video training to join your email list, this is a good way to build an email list. Something that you may want to think about is this. You don't really want to just send out emails which are selling to people all the time. This is not a good way to do it. As a good practice to follow with your email marketing, I recommend about 85% of your emails should be educational and provide some value to your list. This will give you about 10-15% to 15 of the time you should be selling with promotional type emails. A good ratio that you can use is to have less than 10% when it comes to selling products and services, but you can go a little higher than this, but it is a good idea to stay somewhere around there. If you send out too many emails that are simply selling something, you will find it more challenging to build trust and rapport with your audience and you won't have an engaged audience because you're not building a relationship with them. The people on your list will not buy from you and you will most probably burn them out. The third step you can take is to engage more with your audience. You can do this by asking some questions or when you get a question from them, if you respond to them in a timely manner, that will help you build a more engaged audience. This will take some work on your part, but it's still worth doing this and you should not really expect a response or two to make someone into a more loyal fan on your list. To build this email list, you'll need to spend some time and you do this just really helping people out to make them feel loyal. The fourth step you can take is to not give any type of generic responses. You want to give people more specific and personalised advice that helps them. If you give people generic advice, it will likely turn them away and it will not help you turn your followers into becoming more loyal fans and followers. The last strategy I want to give you is to create more video based content in your online business. Let me tell you something. Videos are probably the best way to get your message out there because they help convey emotions and it's much easier for other people to connect with you and your brand through a video as just using text. Now you can go and create long videos teaching people things or maybe the shorter option of short reels. My advice is to generally make some videos that are at least five minutes long each week. And you may also want to create a few videos that are less than a minute long. If you create longer videos of say five minutes or longer, 
try and research topics that your target audience are interested in. You can maybe teach them about solutions to a problem they have or teach them how to do something. When you create a longer form video, you can repurpose them and cut them into shorter videos and you can put them onto social media sites like TikTok, Instagram Reels and also YouTube Shorts. This type of strategy can help you gain more exposure quickly for your business and also help you grow your audience. The next thing to do if you want to know how to start and run an online business then go and click the first link in the description box under the video now and go to our partner website internetbusinessschool.co.uk which is the UK's leading internet marketing training company. I recommend you have a look at the online training courses available. They have courses to suit all needs and experience levels. These courses are perfect for people looking for a new career, business owners and all marketing professionals seeking to boost their skills. It is a fantastic resource which is going to help you develop your digital skills and advance your marketing career and provide you with the training and the knowledge you will need to launch a successful business from start to finish and put you ahead of the competition. Please give the video a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can be notified straight away as soon as I upload new videos. Thank you very much. Please remember to connect on Facebook. I have put the Facebook page link in the description box below this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.